hey what is up everybody and welcome back to another video if you haven't subscribed to my channel be sure to smash that subscribe button and join the fam so welcome back to another review video and the topic of today's video will be the review of the manga one piece chapter 924 this chapter had a title it was a weird name it was titled ha and there was some kind of uh, reference and it was a, there was a translator's note which i wasn't able to understand much any thoughts about this title comment down and now with this chapter the kid law luffy alliance is confirmed that is absolutely possible i can't wait for the chapter to come out and the next chapter is again on break bad timing but in a way the best timing welcome back to this review video okay so the chapter opens up with kaido having smashed luffy unconscious and i think there is a speciality about the club because kaido's underlings they call it that club giving it a specific uh, you know a kind of a more dramatic thought to it so because of that i think there will be some kind of special attachment to this and seeing how the, the wano country has been a craftsman and they can they are able to craft sea prism stones into a nail so it's highly possible that they made a club based on sea prism stone it's possible and despite having become unconscious, he still hasn't lost his will to defeat and beat up Kaido. Because when the underlings of Kaido, they reach out to grab him out, he, even being unconscious, he still keeps on releasing his conqueror's haki. And to this, this annoys Kaido. And there have been a lot of surprises given in this chapter. The first surprise was that the Straw Hat crew, they survived. It was because of the ability of the an old friend of Kinemon, the... Kunoichi and then surprisingly they, they survived the attack the second thing that was bad was surprising was that Shuten Maru he is actually the samurai known as the Ashura Doji and that makes that gives him credibility to his strength because if if Shuten Maru had been a samurai other than the three samurais then their battle power would have increased but since we realize that Shuten Maru and Ashura Doji is are the same person then they, it means that the the thieving band can will have a cope to ally with the luffy and wano alliance we have the ruler of these zo inorashi he has he's he's on the island and he has met up with the group the third surprising thing is that otama hasn't died yet she's just injured extremely and she needs to be treated now despite everything that happened they capture luffy and they take to the dungeons and where there is another information revealed okay first off luffy and kid both both of their cells are beside each other and it seeing them i think there's a chance that they'll have ability to communicate between them like you can hear the voices through the walls the most surprising thing is that in, in the chapter, there was a person who spit out the fish bone and that injured the guy. So if we... On this, there are two theories because the person wasn't shown. So there are two theories for this. The first one is the person who spit it out was Kid. And seeing route that they took to drag Luffy to his cell, it was quite far from the cell from which the bone had come out. So that shows that the person who spit out the bone was not Kid. So if it's not Kid, who was the person who did it and he is feared to such an extent by Kaido's underlings that they haven't done anything. Like they are st they still fear him and it seems that there's a peculiar reason because that person, whoever that person is, he's being fed poison fish and usually the case is when a poison fish is eaten it like you it results in death unless treated and the, the underlings they are specifically told to give the poisoned fish and having removed the bones on this there are two theories again the first one is extremely absurd it could be magnolian but it's not it's not possible at all because the reason for it being magnolian is that it's poison poison the poison can eat poison but that it's extremely far-fetched and it's impossible so i'll have to rule it out the other thing could be uh devil fruit based on bone ability because they are specifically telling to remove out the bones so having bones could make the person stronger so it's possible now luffy's cell is it's besides kids so it's based on this there's a high chance and maybe based on it i think that it could be the same cell also but 
the fact is both of them are beside each other and they haven't lost their will to defeat kaido so based on this there's a high chance that we could see a kid luffy alliance and the rest of law's crew is also in danger because as i said before th- that pirate crew strength is imbalanced with law being extremely strong and the rest of the crew members being weak so based on this there's a extremely uh, disbalance and because of because of this law is forced to escape out another thing to note is that kinemon he rushes out to shuten maru who was the ashura doji and he's now called and he's now called shuten maru and the rest of the pirate crew members they've been notified about what happened to luffy and so with this the first act of the wano arc is over another thing to f- not to forget out is at the ending chapters like there's a kind of curtain that draws towards close towards the cell scene and there was a person with a guitar type ish so is that person somehow linked to all of this and the or it could be just a reference to what the author had there was a kind of small note that happened at the end of every chapter and it said that this is the end of the first act of the wano arc so like maybe there are several stages to this arc like this is the first time that this has happened because i don't remember seeing such act wise in the in an entire arc so it's i'm hyped up for the chapter in the next week there will be a break for this chapter so i'll be doing a one piece related video so be sure to check that out as well and yeah that's the end of this video thanks for watching and i hope you guys have an amazing day ahead of you and i hope you guys like this video and if you did be sure to hit that like button and smash the subscribe button as well and comment down what you guys thought about this review and comment down what you guys thought about this chapter and be sure to check out my informative video series as well and i hope you guys have an amazing day ahead of you until later my manga fans bye